Welcome to day one of our integrated care board, a really exciting opportunity for us to join together to improve health outcomes for citizens and patients in our area. I'm really hopeful that some of the traditional barriers within our care system are going to be uh, ironed out by working in a more integrated way and that actually people will see that we're working really closely together and they won't know which system or which service they're being supported by because we'll all look very similar and we'll all talk to each other and work really efficiently together. An example of that is where we've come together in COVID. We could never have managed the COVID pandemic if we hadn't worked with each other and in partnership. Um, examples of that, for example, would be the way we've managed patients in critical care, where we've provided mutual aid to each other. Another example is where we've all joined together on the vaccine programme, and that was you know, every part of the system working together to give the vaccine programme to save people, people's lives. I think there's a real opportunity here for us to join up more effectively services for children in the local authority and services for children in the NHS. In particular, I think we can together improve services for children's mental health, which uh, is an urgent priority. This is an opportunity to end the unwarranted variation in service provision in the area and for the sharing across the ICS of good practice. For me, it's about join up, it's about connection, it's about making sure that we've got the same goals, the same intent, but also recognising our differences within our communities and what works better for communities working within those communities to help them improve their health and wellbeing. We're putting together an alliance of voluntary community and social enterprise organizations, an alliance which will be part of the integrated care system. And what this means is that community organizations, the ones who know communities, who understand community needs, are going to have a seat at the table of decision making about health and care issues. And that's a real game changer and something that hasn't existed before in our health and care system. prevention will have as key a role as treatment uh, for health and care needs and we will see the right care in the right place at the right time for us all as citizens of the ICS. Today marks the beginning of bringing together all our partners as we form the Integrated Care Board. In Hampshire and Isle of Wight we've got a strong track record of working together as partners and this is the next step to really build on what we've done over the years but to do more and faster. We know we are better together and we're really looking forward to taking this next step.